Today I'm going to do a short video on the Fog Lights 2016 Ram Eco Diesel. Um, this will go for uh, pretty much any of the Ram models out there that have the oblong lights. Um, I did purchase this in 2016 and had it since it was new. Uh, these fog lights are uh, very simple to replace. They're recessed in the front bumper, but if uh, you go right underneath the bumper, there's three bolts. They're all number 10s. Um, you take those out and uh, the headlight releases disconnect the connector and then uh, there's one um, uh, compression Hold, fitting that holds the uh, wire to the back of the light you can you know use a screwdriver pry that out and uh, it's out literally three minutes time the reason I'm making this video is because I've had uh, this truck and actually while I was still under warranty I had it in the dealership for service during that time there were uh, uh, there was a time where I, I picked my truck up and when I got it home I noticed this big crack in this front headlight. It wasn't there when I dropped it off but it was there when I picked it up. It's, uh, here's the unit and as you can see that crack in it. I thought at the time that <clears throat> they had somebody back into it or hit it somehow. Of course a little dispute with the dealership and they Told me it wasn't them, but they went ahead and ordered one for me uh, as a courtesy. So, you know, kudos for them for that. But then again, they should have just ran it under warranty, which they probably did. Um, they probably didn't pay for it. But nevertheless, uh, they did run it through. Of course, they told me it was a uh, impact and uh, road hazard not covered. So that's what this uh, whole thing's about, is to let you guys know, if you do end up with these cracks and you're still under your bumper to bumper warranty, uh, don't let them tell you that it's an impact, because as you can see, now my driver's side has the same thing. It has a, not exactly as big, not as brutal, but it has a crack there, and I'm not sure if you can see it from the photo, but there's another, another fracture right here. Yeah, you can see it right there. So there's several fractures inside, and uh, of course mine's out of warranty now for this cosmetic. They're not going to replace it. But it's not the worst thing in the world. That one's not as bad viewing as this one was. Uh, and I'll be honest with you, it, it took me about a year before I even just installed this light. But if you do have that problem, I want to make sure you're aware that it is not an impact and it is something that should be under warranty it is the heat from the halogen light bulb that creates that cracking effect and this one's brand new obviously there's nothing on it this one has the two cracks and it doesn't show up too easily but there's several fractures here 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 there's there's more fractures in the lens and uh, there's a bunch of little fractures around this one. I'll take this one in the shade. You can see it better. <clears throat> On this one here, you can see the big crack. And there are fractures underneath it. There's another one right there. Now, to prove this was not an impact, <clears throat> I basically figured I'd see how tough these things were by taking the claw of a roofer hammer and beat into it. Obviously since this unit is no longer any good, it's not going to matter, matter if I break it or not. So an impact going down the road at 70 miles an hour with a rock probably will not hit it that hard. At that hard, you can see it left a mar on it, but it did not crack the unit. And that's that's a heavy hit. You can hit it, you can see where I've hit it like five times. Let's go down here in the corner. Sounds like it hits hard. Sounds like it cracks, but there's no way because it leaves a mar on the unit but it doesn't actually crack it like that. So, 
if you guys come up with fractures in your lights and uh, the dealer wants to say something about it maybe just give them a show of this and explain the reason why those fractures kind of give that little horse shape look or uh, moon look is because it is the extreme heat inside causing the acrylic to uh, pop like that and crack hope this helps somebody Matrix to see out.